event for the i4 and the iX. So without further ado, let's get started at looking at this i4 right here. So right here is the Gamecube i4 Codor. Um, and it's a very nice green color. It looks really dark in some lights and really light in some lights. See, like if you look right here on the door, hand on the door handle, it's a little bit of a light green. And then down here is a really dark green. stitching on the steering wheel um, to look like BMW's emblem uh, for the M. It has blue lights on the side here, uh, wireless charging in the cup holder, carbon fiber um, cover right here, as well as carbon fiber center, console and dash, um, as well as the infotainment screen has two dual, dual climate control. Um, you even have the options for sport. There's three options for sport. And then there's one option for comfort. And then eco, pro, standard, and individual. And then on the inside as well, we have very comfortable seats. Although, I think the seat color was not good for this launch event because it is getting really dirty really fast. Uh, it's a nice color though, and if you take care of it, it can look really good from the outside. To pop the hood, you have to pull this latch right here two times because if you didn't know, BMW has two latches on each side. So that's why they're asking you to So this is how you pop it open, you just pull it up. There isn't any safety latch or anything, you just pull it up. Uh, so here is where the batteries are located underneath this plastic cover. And I don't think it was the best position on BMW. Because if someone whacks the car real hard into like a pole or something, batteries are gonna get sliced open and fall. Yeah. Although I, I probably has a lot of, it probably has a lot of safety features that will stop it from that happening. But maybe they should have located like Tesla underneath the car. I might just set it there that way if anyone else wants to. This is how you charge the car. So basically right where the uh, gas uh, tank would be, this is where you charge it. So there's AC and DC, which is kind of cool. All right, Dave's pulling this tank. I can see you. Um, now let's move on to the I IX. Yeah, it's like a crystal glass and I 
inside this car is also fully electric. It, it's at 87% and it has 316 miles. So probably better mileage than the um, i4, as well as all the uh, a, a lot of buttons have. It's tough. So on the inside, we also have this interior is comfortable. The steering wheel looks very futuristic. Very small airbag. Uh, this is like a glass finish as well. Um, we have wood on the center with all the modes over here. You just press on it, home, media, telephone, all that. And then the same crystal as over there. Start and stop right here. Uh, you press the brake, press start. Although if the vehicle ha has no key right now. Uh, right over here you have your normal BMW storage spots. Under here you have two um, plugs because these are literally only what phone makers give you these days. Two cup holders, 12 volt right here. Um, hazards up here. Um, this is the defrosters and this is a very long vent right here. Uh, now let's move on to the back. texture um, I can't tell what that is I would say that's carbon fiber but that's probably not true don't quote me on that on the back here if you didn't notice BMW actually has your door handles for this car so you pull up here kind of like a Lamborghini and it locks it up and it unlocks it you can pull it open get inside Inside of the BMW iX right here, we have four charging ports over here, uh, a little slider that I don't even know what goes in there. Um, a lot of space, very comfortable seats as well, a lot of cushioning. Uh, you can see right through the window from right here, which is always an issue in our family. We always have to sit in the middle and annoy each other. You can just see right through there from where I am, you can see right to the front. Uh, you have a vent right here, Harman Kardon speaker system, and BMW has the doors that open like a Tesla. And in the case of that failing, you have a bottom latch right here to unlock it. Um, but I can't figure out how to make it work because I think the child lock is on on these doors, so like I can't really get out. And that's why this clip took so long to uh, take it Then in the back here, we have another charging port um, and that is a big big door right there in the back fully electric on the inside we have quite a bit of trunk space if you fold the seats down you'll get even more uh, you have the shade right here very small window up there um, this is, I think that's to save you when you're locked inside. This is how the, uh, this is like a secondary tail light. So if you're driving with something back here and you can't close the back, this is your tail light, a secondary tail light. And that's all for this.
the max range of the BMW i4 M50, these two vehicles in the showroom, is A, 270, B, 222, C, 218, or D, 258. 270. 270. 270. Oh. 270. Oh. There we go. Oh, you got it again. Oh. Yeah. 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 Alrighty. We have the final question here tonight. The last chance for free money, guys. Hey, so the charge time. Zero to 100% on the IX on two 40 volt charger. Is it 18 hours, 15 hours, 13 hours, or 12 hours? Hopefully the only YouTuber.